So in this video, we're going to do a thick plate. It's about 15 mil. We're doing an open root single V. The preps at around about 45 degrees and we've got a landing edge on the nose of around about a millimeter. So on this joint, we're using 85 amps with 2.4 millimeter ER70S welding wire. So we've split screen this for you to show you the front and the reverse view. So I'm using a dip technique. So I'm melting both of the edges away with a slight weave and then we're feeding wire in. As you can see from the back, the penetration is pushing through so that the run is over flush and we have reinforcement on the back. So as with all TIG welds, we're trying to get into a rhythm. So we're maintaining the same pool size. We're feeding exactly the same amount of wire. So we're moving up, keeping a nice consistent travel speed to maintain the size of the run. Obviously if we get wider and we get slower then this will affect our route and the amount of penetration that we're pushing through. As we don't want to create too much reinforcement we're looking for around about one and a half mil of reinforcement on the back side but then on certain well procedures they may stipulate that that may be slightly different. So this is one technique. There are different techniques out there. Everybody has got a slight variation on what they actually do. But the aim is when we've got the wire down in the bottom of the prep is keeping it right in the bottom. If we push the wire too far back, then we potentially will be overfilling and we'll be pushing too much metal through to the other side. And if we bring the wire too far forward, then potentially we may get sucked back. So the root will be under flush. So the main key is the size of your gap. As you can see here, the molten pool is fusing both sides reinforcements coming through and we're controlling that pool nice all the way up to the end of that run so to finish off we're going to do a little cheeky quiz we're going to show you three routes let's see if you can identify the TIG route as one of the others is MIG and the other one is stick and on screen now is our TIG welding series which is going to show you more welding techniques on various types of joints <laughs> 